And to health sector now, implementation of policies on exclusive breastfeeding is key to achieving the 2025 World Health Assembly a target of raising the rate of exclusive breastfeeding in the first six months to at least 50% and could prevent maternal mortality. This came to the fore at the training for women as a change agent in the exclusive breastfeeding organized by the societies scaling up nutrition in Nigeria in collaboration with the Federal Ministry of Health. Basi Taiban reports. Early introduction of breastfeeding within the first one hour of birth, exclusive breastfeeding for the first six months in life, and continued breastfeeding for up to two years or beyond are some of the rights of the child that experts say, if implemented, could place Nigeria at par with other African countries who are already at 70% while Nigeria is at 29. Because of the benefits, the benefits to the child, evidence abounds on the health importance, health benefits of breastfeeding and breast milk. In fact, somebody described breast milk as um, uh, a great vaccine, uh, a great food, and of course, a great investment. It was time to share experiences, myths, and misconceptions concerning exclusive breastfeeding where these abuse from their minds, including the fact that breast milk alone cannot satisfy a baby. That is having children cry and breastfeed your child. It's important. Your child breast, let them breastfeed food for their mouth. The role of women in improving nutrition situation and exclusive breastfeeding in Nigeria, as well as the importance of exclusive breastfeeding were highlighted. As 2021 Breastfeeding Week winds down, stakeholders appeal for the cooperation of all, a conducive environment at workplaces, and the extension of maternity leave to at least six months to encourage exclusive breastfeeding in the country. Basi Taipa, NTA News.